Oh why, hello there, and welcome. My name is Orisau, and I am here to introduce you to the 33rd Regiment of Food. <laughs> Since the 33rd is a big regiment, it is currently split up into five main companies. The 2nd Company. The 3rd Company. The 4th. The Lights. And the Cavalry Detachment. Number 2 Company, also known as the Duke's Own, is the main centre company of the regiment, currently led by Lieutenant Colonel Kincaid. The company focuses on playing as line infantry, the main unit of the game, thus all new members will be automatically assigned to it. The main aim of the company, as well as attending events and warm-ups, is teaching and encouraging the more inexperienced members how to work together and showing them the basics of the game and the melee system in it. In addition to normal trainings prior to events, the company also offers boot camps twice a week for members to improve individually on their own various melee techniques. Hello, my name is Blaze, I'm the leader and lieutenant of the number 3 KJO company here in the 33rd. My main goal during events is to make sure that everybody has a great experience and that everyone has fun. I currently have one NCO in the company who is Sergeant Major Dom. He is always available to talk to by any means whether it be related to the game or not. We're a small company with roughly 10 attendants per event. This means that Team Fleet isn't as loud as the number 2 company. I aim for everyone to be laid back during events but we do expect some form of discipline from all of our members to make sure events run smoothly and relaxed. Oh why, hello there! My name is Odysseus, and I'm going to be talking to you about the 33rd's number 4 company, known as the Glasgow Lowlanders. It is a line company led by Sergeant Major Scarhead. Although we are a small company, we are trying our best to get our attendants and members to improve. Our main aims are to have fun in events, help inexperienced players by improving their knowledge and understanding of the game and its physics. Acquire new members and achieve high attendance while at the same time making sure everyone in the company is having fun. The members that you will most likely meet on a daily basis is Scarhood who leads the company into battle, Buns who is second in command and deals with nearly all the administration stuff, and me, Odysseus, who is the shining star in the company. The Light Company is a melee focused company, made up of not only 33rd veterans, but also up and coming members looking to fight at a more competitive level. During events, the Light Company acts as a guerrilla force, being able to take enemy regiment one on one, whether it be line, cav, or light force, often utilizing ambush tactics. The Lights are the most free in terms of formation and rules of any company. They have no need to walk in line but instead can spread out to a five-man spacing and can take cover behind trees and rocks. Due to the flexibility required in game and being a limited number company, activity and skill are equally important which is why the light company is invitational only. The cavalry company is currently led by Captain Flashcoms and our main jobs are supporting other companies, engaging enemy cav and charging lines that aren't paying attention. We almost always play SRs, but we're open to changing things up when the situation calls for it, and Mechel really wants us to play Dragoons. Do you want to join a small company that can joke around while maintaining some form of discipline? Do you really like horses? Then apply for Cavalry Company and schedule some overtime with your therapist today. So the first step. The promotion to private is awarded at the company staff discretion but primarily requires the following criteria. You must have been enlisted in the regiment for at least two weeks and you must have attended at least two events or trainings during this period. The second step. When you eventually are promoted to private, you may opt between the many companies by making an application in the forums, except the lights that are invitation only. If you decide to stay in the number two company, you will have to pass the Fusiliers test. Basically, it's a melee test available each Monday where you fight an officer. 
If the officer thinks that you are capable, then you should pass the test. However, if this does not happen, you will improve your melee skills every week until you eventually pass the test. We may be a regiment and we may want some discipline and seriousness during events and trainings, but we are also a community where we share our interests and have fun together. Here you will find people with the same interests as you, and many have made great friendships here, so don't be afraid to speak with new people. We also have a website where you may communicate with the community and post whatever you wish. Of course, we also have a Steam group where you can find every member of the regiment. Our current events are scheduled at 7pm GMT every Wednesday, Saturday and Sunday and before each event we have a warm-up or a training. We also have a melee training, so-called boot camp, at 6.15pm on Mondays and Saturdays. On the Wednesdays we have a conquest event, Saturday we have a line only event and Sunday we have a normal line battle where we have skirmishers, cavalry and the lions fighting each other. We also host a historic event every month on the Wednesdays. Fridays at 7 p.m. we have a hold fast event and on Saturdays at 8 p.m. we have a mod event called New England Army event where we play various modern blade mods. Usually we play Vixen and Tories but we also play Iron Europe and Blood and Iron. We are a regiment where our objectives are 50-50, fun and competition, so remember to have fun and God save the Queen.